A labeling petition with 3,250 signatures to the governor's office. You didn't set well, up an appointment? Um, That'll be all right. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> well, we don't have a big speech or anything, uh, but um, let me at least briefly tell you what it is yes. so you can pass that along. So these, uh, these good people are New Mexicans along with myself. I don't represent them. I just got chosen to make, the, make this quick introduction. And um, what they have is a, uh, a petition mm -hmm. that was signed by uh, well, over 3,200 people. And a few of them who didn't sign it, who arrived, added their signatures to uh, the back of this top copy. Mm -hmm. We're also giving you a second copy. And this is not a full copy of all the signatures, okay. but it's representative, and a full copy can be provided. And, I, and if this, I can leave some contact information if the PR guy would like that, you know, for mm -hmm. authentication. Um, I will volunteer to be the person who can contact and arrange that. Okay. Um, but basically, it's a one-sentence petition <laughs> that simply says that uh, we don't want genetically modified foods to be unlabeled and therefore unidentifiable in the state. There are several states that have passed out. Several more initiatives are ongoing. It's something of a movement. Uh, we would like. Uh, New Mexico, which is an agricultural state, to join that movement, and that's basically what it's about. Okay. So I'm sure that's as much, or maybe even more, than you personally need to know. But at least you have an idea what it is. Okay. Can you can you read the the petition? Yeah, Just sure. One sentence. It's very short. Very short. I have to take off my glasses to do it. Uh, petition statement: Label genetically modified organisms in New Mexico, so people can make informed decisions about the food they purchase and feed their families. And several of us, I'm sure, are able to probably literally lecture as to why this is a good idea, but it stands on its own. Yeah. People want to know, they have a right to know. It's that simple. So and this was started by an organic farmer in New Mexico. Yes, whose name is about three weeks ago. So it's already gathered over three thousand two hundred and fifty signatures in just three weeks. And this is it's a New Mexico initiative. It's, you yes. know, nobody made us do this. No. <laughs> So, I assume you can uh, provide the 3,200 uh, signatures electronically. Sure. Instead well, of printing yeah, by any means pages. necessary. And of course, we'd recommend that you also meet and speak with your uh, legislators as well. That is in the works as well. Great. Okay. Is there any, anyone else who'd like to say anything? Um, I think we could be real leaders this way instead of seeing it as a, you know, there's, there's been some. Um, backlash about it, but in New Mexico, our locally grown foods are super important to, to us and as an economic function in the state, and we could be very proud to, you know, identify how our food's grown. So, I, you know, that's why I'm supporting it. I grow a lot of my food, so I know where it comes <laughs> from. Anyway, uh, is there anything else we can tell you about that would be helpful? Nope. I will make sure this gets the appropriate personnel. And, and well, can, they make it can you give me, I'm sure I could look it up, but can you give me the name or write it down on a little piece of paper of the, of the PR guard and maybe uh, yeah, have hasten, a hasten or the file through and make it easier? So who would be the appropriate guy that you would give this to? <laughs> if you want it to go to the communications director, that's who it will go to. The communications director. What about the governor? Yeah, we can. We can get it into her hands as well. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that would be good. That's the we point of all of us coming right down here. here. <laughs> and then, like I, like okay. I stressed Great. earlier, Great. I would Thank stress meeting with your legislature, your legislators, as they are the ones who introduce bills on the floor. Yes, and yeah. they're the ones I've written them many times. So. Right, so I would... Uh, we know that they're, they're in recess, so we want yeah. them to... Especially recommend trying to get a meeting on the books with them as well. There was a bill introduced this past session yes. that passed one committee in... Senate Bill 17. 18. 18. Correct. There you go. I remember it. <laughs> I remember everybody here that uh, came in support, and uh, I remember really? seeing everybody in committee. Well, we thank you for your courtesy. Thank yes. you. And your attention. And if there are other people who have things to say, I'm going to step out of the way. I've done my job. <laughs> Great. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you very much. Thank you. Thank you. It's, no a, it's a clear It's a clear initiative. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs>